what I'm witnessing in the NBA with Ingram and Bill, are you for real? That sounds so ridiculous. And I'm going to tell you the reason why. When Moses Malone was sent to the Sixers, everyone was put in place. Julius, Maurice Cheeks, Andrew Tony, everyone was put in place. They was just missing that key element, Moses Malone. And they won a championship. For the Lakers to pay $154 million for LeBron James, a player who had already won three NBA championships with two different teams, and to bring him to the Lakers with these wannabe up-and-coming stars that never won a championship? Are you kidding me? And you think it's supposed to be a fit? The ridiculous. What is so absurd to think the sending Ingram to Washington for Bill? Are you for real? No. Ernie Grunfeld. Keep Wall. Keep Bill. And send that sore ass to White Howard off to whatever team you chose and do whatever you can to get Anthony Davis as a Wizards. Bill Wall and Anthony Davis, two Kentuckys, oh, it's locked down now. The West is in trouble because the East is the beast and the Wizards will be the beast. It's over with. So as far as Ingram going to Washington for Bill, the pieces are still not in place with the Lakers. I hate to say it, but Magic and Palenka, whatever, oh, listen, these guys are not going to last long in the front office with the Lakers. Because for them to even bring LeBron to the Lakers without everybody put in place, it's ridiculous. And now LeBron, Le LeBron, the young king, I call him the young king because he is the young king. There's only one king, and that's Bernard King. The young king, he's getting ready to crack. He will be cracking. And when he do, he's going to say, look, guys, enough is enough. I'm just here to play the ball. So you're going to have to do what needs to be done. And I hate to say it, but it is what it is. Got to go.